Praise the Lord Church. Today's Bible meditation is taken from 2 Kings chapters 17 and 18 and Acts chapter 22. If you're new to Living God Family, a very warm welcome to you in Jesus' name. Hope this video will be a blessing to you as you hear and listen to the thoughts as we read through the Bible together. I encourage you to read the chapters during your personal devotion time and become recipients of listening to God's voice daily. 2 Kings chapter 18 verses 4 through 6. He removed the high places and broke the sacred pillars, cut down the wooden image and broke in pieces the bronze serpent that Moses had made. For until those days the children of Israel burned incense to it and called it Nehushtan. He trusted in the Lord God of Israel, so that after him was none like him among all the kings of Judah, nor who were before him. For he held fast to the Lord, he did not depart from following him, but kept his commandments which the Lord had commanded Moses. God the Almighty delights in those that follow him wholeheartedly. Hezekiah followed God of his fathers faithfully, and he lived a life making his priority to please God than people. In the New Testament, Saul, who later became Paul, was zealous to stop the work of God and please the high priest and their words by persecuting followers of Christ until he met Jesus on the road to Damascus and experienced by himself the truth that changed his life from being a people pleaser to a person that pleased God. May we experience Christ and know him deeper as we walk with him daily so that our spiritual eyes can be opened to see the truth that is in Jesus and come closer to the Almighty to please him alone in all our ways. As we read in Acts chapter 22 verses 6 through 8. Now it happened as I journeyed and came near Damascus at about noon, suddenly a great light from heaven shone around me. And I fell to the ground and heard a voice saying to me, Saul, Saul, why are you persecuting me? So I answered, Who are you, Lord? And he said to me, I am Jesus of Nazareth, whom you are persecuting. Praise be to our wonder-working God. In Jesus' name, Amen. Thank you for the privilege of your time in watching the videos and being part of Living God community. God bless you all abundantly as we are all created to be holy and happy in Jesus. Amen.